All right. Today I'm going to be making a video on how to play safer against the dagger. Now I do want to start this video out and say I'm sorry if this video seems a little bit lackluster in comparison to my last video regarding the greatsword, but there are a few things you should know about when you're going against the dagger. Some of them you may already know about, some of them you may not, and I hope if only a little bit you learn something from this video. So one thing to keep in mind when you're going against the dagger is this right click focus attack is definitely their strongest ability. And why that is, is because this ground stab has three hits and each one of them is inter uninterruptible. Why does that matter? Basically, on the second hit, they can cancel it. So, one, two. And I'm going to show you why that's important in a minute. But basically, why they go for this is because if they land this combo, they get to, they get to do pretty heavy damage on you, okay? Anyways, that's not what I want to show you. What I want to show you is how to punish this ability and show you some loopholes around it. So, so for example, one thing you should know about is if they let it go and they don't cancel it, right after that third ground stab, before his hand touches his knee, right there, there's actually a window that you can punish him you can either apply pressure or get a full combo off if you're using a weapon like the longsword. So, open window. If he touches his knee, right there, you can dodge. So you want to punish him before his hand touches his knee. I know that sounds like it's just probably impossible to do and you can't react to it, but it actually is. Because when they go for this ability, you're going to back dodge out of it. Maintenance. Okay. I'm going to show you an example of this now. That wasn't it. But yeah, you can back dodge all of the dagger's focus attacks. But right there, you can punish him. Now, let's try it again. Okay, you get your punish. Just always remember there's two things that you need to be thinking about on the dagger, and you always want to stay calm against this weapon. If they don't cancel this, you get to punish them. If they do cancel this, I'm going to cut to the part now showing you how to play better against this weapon. It's going to be utilizing a second dodge, because after they cancel this, they're A, going to try and attack you with the soul break, or they're B, going to try and go for the uppercut that they normally would to catch you with the juggle combo. Alright, I'm going to show you a few examples of how to play against this. I'm going to cut to it, they won't have commentary. As you can see, those were a few ideas on how to punish the dagger and how to play more safely against it. Uh, once again, sorry if this video is not as great as the others. I was really trying to find new ideas and ways of countering this weapon to get out to the community. Uh, I do want to say I am looking for new video ideas, so if you have any recommendations, if you just let me know, I might actually make a video for you. Uh, I want to give a special thanks to my friend Splendid for helping me in the custom match and bouncing ideas off me to help make the video better. Uh, he's 
really good with the dagger himself. He mains it in threes, and he is also a Tumult main. If you're interested in any of that, or maybe you might be able to learn something from him, I'm going to go ahead and give his link in the description to his Twitch. And yeah, I think that's about it for me. See ya.